There we go. Hello, everybody, and welcome uh, to my stream. If you've seen my face for the very first time, hi. I'm AC Harry, and we do a lot of Tower Simulator 3 on this uh, channel. In fact, I would go as far as to say that I am the number one streamer in the world for Tower Simulator 3. Hi. Uh, for those of you who are regular viewers, hello. Uh, sorry, it's been a couple of weeks, actually, since my last stream. Um, I have been very unwell, for those of you in the know. Uh, all sorts of health problems. I'm still unwell, I'm, uh, but I'm on the flip side. Uh, slowly getting better. You can probably hear croaky voice, croaky throat. There's all kinds of aches and pains. Uh, but we are here today for one hour pre-recorded stream on a loop. Uh, and uh, we're going to be showcasing MMPR, also known as Puerto Vallarta in Jalisco, Mexico. Hopefully I said all those words properly. Uh, so, uh, quick little bit of a promo then, as usual, uh, at the start of my streams. Uh, if you want to support my stream, please do. Uh, we've got three levels of, uh, membership on Kofi, each with a few, uh, little bits and pieces of perks and BTS behind the scenes for gold. Uh, also, don't forget, you can buy ATC Harry merch. We've got the snap back cap, which comes in different colours. Uh, we've got the mouse mat, which is amazing. I'm looking at it right now on my desk. And we also have the ATC Harry cup. Uh, so definitely back yourself uh, some merch. Uh, also, we have a donation goal today. Uh, it'll be popping up, I think, every 13 minutes or something in the chat. So feel free to contribute and support this channel, but more importantly, support me. Uh, and uh, hopefully um, that number in the top right, wherever, wherever the top right is, that will update as the stream goes on throughout the day. Okay, um, so enough talking. Here is MMPR. We are in the control tower here. Uh, let's have a little look. So, um, straight off the bat, we can see it's just uh, one runway. So, we've got runway 04 and runway 22. Um, so, um, not as much to uh, think about, fingers crossed, uh, compared to some of the uh, other... Um, um, airports that we've been doing recently, such as KSTL, and yeah, that was, that was, <laughs> that was fun. Okay, um, so, um, I'm gonna put our radar on three nautical miles, because why not? Um, wind is coming in at one degree, so we'll be running, uh, uh, runway four today. Uh, I've already got one airplane ready to go, so that's good. Um, what is my frequency? That's a good question. Let's have a little look. What is our frequency for departure? I think it's 119.0. Uh, yes, 119.0. So that's good. All right, let's have a little look around then, like we always do. We like to have a good look around. So maybe if I go start off with the runway. Actually, let's start off with a 360. Just look at the detail of this map, guys. Feel that are making strides. And uh, you know what? It's been an absolute pleasure to test this airport as well prior to release. Because I've seen the stages um, of development from something that doesn't look like this to the masterpiece that it is right now. Just look at that. And the mountains in the distance as well. The sort of hazy... Uh, low-lying fog. It's very, very, very cool. Okay, uh, so quite a long uh, runway, which is good because, you know, long runways are, are always very nice. Uh, what we'll do is we'll start off at the far end of the um, airport and we'll work our way around. So let's see what we have. Also loving that I can go right down close to the ground instead of like being, I don't know, um, over here. We can actually go right down to the ground, which is beautiful. So we've got some deltas to start us off. A couple of deltas. I'm loving these, like, buses as well. Just a bit random. Uh, got some more big planes over here. So we've got a southwest. We haven't seen those for a little while. Sun Country. Uh, quite a rare plane. WestJet. Nice big one as well. Not one of the small ones. Uh, an American plane. I think this is the one that's ready to go straight away off the bat in a minute. Uh, we've got some Air Alaskas. One, two, three of those. So that's quite cool. Uh, round the corner. We've got another Air Alaska. We've got a United. A Southwest. And then, what's this? Ooh, I can go inside the building. That's quite cool. 
That is actually quite cool. It's like it's like being a passenger and like looking through the window at the plane. Isn't that cool? Dang. Okay, uh, we've got an Aviva. No, Viva. Viva Aerobus. Don't think I've seen this one in the game before. Uh, Aero Mexico. Nice planes, those. Another Viva. Here's our control tower. It's got the got the gap on the side, so it's quite cool. A very sort of conventional style uh, control tower. Uh, I remember in testing <laughs> this control tower, it's quite funny to look at in the early uh, phases, but my god, it's amazing now. Right, on the other side of the terminal, we've got loads of private planes. Now, regular viewers will know I'm not a big fan of private planes. And they are here in an absolute abundance. We've got millions of the things. Uh, so lots of private planes, big, small, medium sized. They're all over the place, absolutely all over the place. So I am sure uh, I'm gonna have some fun uh, with these with these planes. We also have a helipad, uh, which is quite unusual. We don't often see helipads. I wonder, I wonder. Is this a sign of things to come? I would love to have helicopters in this game. Please give this video a like if you would like to have helicopters in Tower Simulator 3. Like, wouldn't that be so awesome? So there we go. Uh, that is the terminal. Uh, so a good mix of your uh, sort of big planes and then your um, private planes. I'm ready to hit play. Let's do it. Right, uh, let's get follow mode on. Right, I think for the American, uh, we'll just stay in manual mode to begin with. I'm already here, my friend. I'm already here. There's my overlays as well, guys, but we don't need them just yet. American, 1215, pushback approved. Expect runway 04. So today, guys, um, we're, uh, we're using, as you can see, the Energis uh, design a livery schedule. And we're running the game at 3 p.m. in game time. Because when I was looking um, through the schedule file, I was like, I like to pick the one that's going to give you guys like the most like entertainment, the most action, and so also like the most planes. Uh, and 3 to 4 p.m. was a good balance between planes coming in and planes departing. Now I realize I've been gabbing for 10 minutes, um, so it's not going to be quite a full hour, um, but... But we should see a nice selection uh, of incoming and outgoing planes over the course of the uh, next sort of 50 minutes. I uh, really have missed uh, streaming Tower Simulator 3 over the past couple of weeks while I've been poorly. Uh, really sorry I've not been able to stream. I, sh I don't even feel I should be streaming right now to be honest. Uh, but I'm not letting my friends at Fuel Bear down with this uh, day one stream of uh, Puerto uh, Vallarta in uh, Mexico. And to be honest, it is, it is nice to be back. I'm hoping next week uh, we're going to be back to a somewhat normal timetable. It's very much going to be dependent on how I feel. Uh, there will be some changes coming up as well uh, to my timetable in the... Um, days and weeks ahead as I just tweak a few things, uh, but more on that as time goes on. American 1215, continue taxi. Continue taxi. Right, now I American wonder, could I get him to take off on Bravo? Like, this could be like an interesting experiment. Uh, for the moment though, let's, let's, uh, Let's watch. So this is um, this is American one two one five uh, taxiing towards runway zero four here in Mexico. Always been a big fan of these uh, American planes. They're very very cool. Let's see if we can get a sort of into camera shot there. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. <clears throat> I 
Now, no clips today, guys. You'll be happy to know. Um, can't do clips on a pre-record, sadly. Um, but we will be going clip crazy in the uh, streams that lie in front of us. So cool. Shall I see if we can get this guy onto Bravo? Let's try. American 1215, runway 04 at Bravo. Let's see what he says. Runway 04 at Bravo. American 1215. Ooh, he will actually do that. Okay. I'll update my little notepad there. Because there's no point going all the way to the end of the runway. Um, if we can get him off quicker at an earlier intersection, do you know what I mean? Oh, yes. Absolutely beautiful. So, uh, this is Delta here. This is Delta. Um, what have we got over here? Not sure. Oh, wait. That's Charlie. Well, that would make sense. So, this is going to be Bravo. Uh, let's just double check. Yep, that's Bravo, 0422, 04 is one runway, 22 is the runway on the other side, if, if people don't understand what that means. And then we should have the sort of the main um, sort of part of the runway here, which would be Alpha. And it's uh, just 04 down here, because this is 04. And if we were to go to the other end, it should say 22. Let's have a little look. There you go. Two, two. It's quite cool, isn't it? Right, where is my American friend? Let's put the lock on there for a minute. There he is. So he's uh, just coming up to Bravo now. So he should be turning right uh, in a moment. Right now, yep. And then he should hold and wait uh, for the command to line up and wait. Uh, we'll stay in follow mode as we uh, prepare for our first takeoff here at Puerto Vallarta in Jalisco, Mexico. Try and say it like the way they would say it, but I'm <laughs> probably failing miserably. Right, are we ready, guys? Let's get him onto the runway, shall we? He should stop. Yep, yeah, there we go. American 1215, runway 04, line up and wait. We've got a uh, Southwest primed uh, as well, um, so we'll we'll say hello. To, okay, let's get him going now. Southwest one zero nine zero with information alpha, requesting push and start. Southwest one zero nine zero pushback approved. Expect runway zero four. Ground runway zero four pushback approved. Southwest one zero nine zero. Right, guys, who's ready uh, for our first takeoff? We'll just wait for the rev of the engines. Oh, so nice. Okay, wind is 016. It's changing slightly. American 1215, wind is 016 degrees at zero knots. Runway 04 cleared for takeoff. Let's enjoy our first ever. Take off. Very excited. The uh, cinematics are actually really nice um, at this airport. Uh, especially landings. It comes in over the water. You'll see later on, guys. I'm, it's absolutely stunning. Um, reminds me of... I think it might be K-Boss sort of coming in over the water. Except this time, there's just nothing. It's just water. It's just sea. It's beautiful. Uh, so hopefully we can see some... Uh, some of those spectacular landings uh, later on. Meanwhile, this is American 1215 taking off um, on runway 04 at intersection Bravo. Yeah, that was absolutely fine. Loads of space there. Loads of space. And you can see it's pretty much um, barren, isn't it, as it takes off. There's only a, a smattering of buildings. American 1215, contact for Lato, departure on 119 and decimal zero. Lato, departure 
departure on 119.0, American 1215, Roger, good day. Good day. Right, he's done, let's get rid of him. Apparently our southwest friend is ready to rumble, there he is. Right, so let's get out of um, follow mode. I'm going to set up some camera angles actually. I feel as if I need some camera angles. Um, so let's let's get a terminal one here. Maybe one for the like one for these types of planes. Uh, so let's do F eight for there. Let's do F nine for the private planes. Let's do um, F ten for runway zero four at Bravo. So maybe if I just sort of do it like this. F10. And we'll do F11. WestJet 2203 with a push and start. So we've got F8, F9, F10, F11. Perfect. Perfect. And here's our Southwest. Southwest 109 at continue taxi. Continue taxi. And the uh, WestJet, he wants to push back as well. Uh, we'll get to him shortly. But first, this is uh, Southwest 109er. Love these planes. Look at that beauty. Look at that beauty, guys. So cool. Right. Uh, shall we get the uh, WestJet pushed back as well? There he is. Let's get him pushed back. WestJet 2203. Pushback approved. Expect runway 04. Ground. Runway oh, zero listen four. to that. Pushback approved. WestJet 2203. Thank you, sir. Oh, there's beautiful engine noises there. Ooh. Ooh. All right, let's go through the terminal again. Right, we're going to leave him pushing back. Um, let's get some uh, shots of this southwest. It's coming. It's coming. United one two four three with information alpha requesting push and start. Oh yes. So freaking cool, guys. United one two four three pushback approved. Expect runway zero four. Right, where's that United? Ground runway zero four. There he is. And the WestJet is pushing back. And then there's the Southwest taxiing down. This is what the overlays look like. WestJet 2203 ready to taxi. Um, so we've got a few little bits and pieces um, on the go right now. Shall we get the Southwest going all the way to the bottom of the runway this time? Uh, just so we can sort of see from the from the sort of very beginning of the runway what that takeoff. A hurdle looks like. Right, let's get the WestJet uh, going. WestJet 2203, runway 04 at Bravo. We'll send him to Bravo. Runway 04 at Bravo. WestJet 2203. Lovely. No incoming planes yet, uh, but we should have some soon. Keeping my fingers crossed. The Southwest is making good progress. He's uh, just coming up to Bravo now. It'll be you should go right past Bravo, straight to the end of the um, airport. In fact, if I press F uh, F10, get my key binds right. I'll just hop into manual for a couple of minutes. Ground, United 1243, ready to taxi. That's nice. Mm 
And from another angle. Lovely sunny day here in Puerto Vallarta. So cool. Right, he's lining up, ready to go. Southwest 109, runway 04, line up and wait. Runway Some countries zero, ready to go as well. Southwest 109. Some country 536, pushback approved, expect runway 04. Thank you, sir. There you go. You can see the big zero four on the ground there as well, and just as the as the plane goes over it. Now we wait. Oh yeah. Southwest one zero nine zero. Wind is. 31 degrees at zero knots, runway zero four, cleared for takeoff. Runway zero four, cleared for takeoff. Southwest one zero nine. Let's do this. Coming up, uh, we've got the West Jet taking off. On Bravo, uh, we've got United uh, to start taxiing, and we also have the Sun Country uh, to start taxiing as well. So uh, a few more takeoffs coming up. No landings yet. No one's appeared on my uh, deep rides. Come on, guys. I need at least one landing. Anyway, here we go. This is Southwest 109 taking off on runway 04. Look at the difference. He takes off halfway. And when we take for Bravo, it's pretty much at the end. It's interesting. Southwest 109, contact Velata, departure on 119, decimal zero. Velata, departure on 119.0, Southwest 109. Roger, good day. All right, let's get rid of this, the uh, WestJet. He's almost at Bravo as well, actually. Let's just go back into F10, get my angles right here. And then we've got two planes to get rid of simultaneously. Our West Jets just appeared on the uh, radar as well. Have a look, guys. There it is. It's just popped up in the corner there. West Jet 2203, runway 04, line up and wait. Runway 04, line up and wait. West Jet 2203. Very fast, this guy, isn't he? <laughs> right, where's he gonna stop? There we go. There we go. Oh, he's ready instantly, this guy. WestJet 2203, wind is 37 degrees at zero knots, runway 04, cleared for takeoff. There we go. WestJet 2203, contact Velarta departure on 119 decimal zero. Velarta departure on 119.0, WestJet 2203. All right, guys. Roger. Good day. Good day. All right, we've got a few, um, a few bits and pieces to do here. Let's get this United going. Actually, let's get the Sun Country going first. 
Actually, no. <laughs> Let's do the United first. United, one, two, four, three. Runway zero, four at Bravo. Runway zero, four at Bravo. United, one, two, four, three. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Off you go, sir. Look at that. Love these United planes. Alert ground, Alaska 1377 with information. Beautiful. Requesting push and start. Right, let's get rid of the Sun Country as well. Sun Country 536, runway 04 at Bravo. Gonna start getting busy in a minute, guys. Runway We've got planes four. coming in. We've got Bravo. planes going out. Five, it's gonna get, start getting very, very, very busy. WestJet 2214, runway 04, clear to land. Runway 04, cleared to land. WestJet 2214. X-ray Bravo Sierra Golf Juliet, runway 04, clear to land. Runway 04, cleared to land. X-ray Bravo Sierra Golf Juliet. There's the overlays. Starting to get a little bit busy. A little bit busy. Love these planes. There's some very, very cool Sun Country planes, let me tell you. Some very, very cool ones, and this is one of them. Alrighty, uh, we have got an Air Alaska as well, somewhere. Here it is. Alaska 1377, pushback approved, expect runway 04. Ground, runway 04, pushback approved. Alaska 1377. Okay, good. Um, right. We'll be having our first landing momentarily, guys. It's happening very, very soon. Let's have a quick check-in with our United friend. Oh, yeah. He's nearly, nearly, nearly at uh, Bravo. November 701 at Coax Ray with information alpha. Requesting push and start. November 701 Echo X-Ray approved. Expect runway 04. Negative. We tried to push back by hand, but we failed. Oh, Zine, push Please back? Please send a push back truck. All right, but November first. November Here's our first landing. Do you see what I mean about the sea? This is just so beautiful. You've got like, uh, like a, like a sea haze as well, like low-lying cloud and stuff. It's so cool. November 701 Echo X ray pushback approved. Expect runway 04. There we go. Ground. It's going to be quite busy runway now. 04. Look at the shadow pushback on the ground approved. as well. So cool. You can see like the November beach under the water. Then over the beach, ground. straight That's into like a little three, forest seven, area seven, with the landing taxi. lights interspersed between. And straight down onto runway 04. Look at the double edged uh, tail. Uh, a wing fin as well. Very, very cool. Very, very um, aerodynamic. Right. There's no time to get a takeoff going. Uh, just, but we've got another one coming up really close behind, actually. Let's have a quick look here as well. It's starting to get busy. WestJet 2152 Heavy, runway 04, clear to land. Looks like a small one, this one. Uh, I just want to quickly... Actually, no, there's no time. No time. Alaska 1377, continue taxi. Continue taxi. Alaska 1377. That is so cool. Bang on the ground. November 701, a coax ray ready to taxi. Very, very, very cool, this guy's. So cool. Right, it's definitely getting busier now. Delta 1922 with information. Alpha requesting push and Right, we've got time to get rid of one plane. 
United 1243, runway 04, cleared for immediate takeoff. Runway 04. WestJet 2214, taxi to ramp via Alpha. Valarda Tower, American 1287, final zero. I don't think he heard me. WestJet 2214, taxi to ramp via Alpha Foxtrot. There you go, perfect. Taxi to ramp via Alpha Foxtrot. Alaska 1377, hold position. Position. Oh blimey, it is getting busy. <laughs> I'll take off. Right, let's see if we can uh, manage all these planes. American 1287, runway 04, clear to land. Runway 04, clear to land. American 1287. Thank you. We're only just managing this as well because there's uh, um, another WestJet coming in shortly. In fact, straight after this, I'm going to transition to that pretty much now. United 1243, contact Valata, departure 119 and decimal zero. Valata, departure on 119 Let's just check in what's United going on here. Where are you? Oh, he's here. There he is. Wow, look at that shot. That was amazing. Holy crap, that was such a cool shot. X-Ray Bravo Sierra Golf Juliet, taxi to ramp. This is a huge plane. Taxi to ramp. X-Ray Bravo Damn. Sierra Golf Juliet. Right. I just want to check on that guy, actually. Where is he taxiing to? Okay, that's fine. That's good. Um... You've landed now. Good, good, good. So we can get rid of the Sun Country. Sun Country 536, runway 04, line up and wait. There's only just runway enough time to get rid of him. Um, the Alaskan has got Bell spare space tower. now. Alaska 1377, runway 04 at Bravo. Good. And we can get rid of this dude as well. Might be able to send him to Alpha. No. Charlie. November 701 X-Ray Echo. <laughs> I said that wrong. November 701 Echo X-Ray. Runway 04 at Charlie. Say again. Oh, no time. Sun Country 536, Charlie. runway 04, November cleared for immediate takeoff. No time. Sorry. Runway Sorry, zero little itty bitty plane. Sun right. Uh, this guy here, he needs to go. WestJet 2152, heavy taxi to ramp. Taxi to ramp. WestJet 2152, heavy. Alright, this one's taking off. It's getting very busy all of a sudden. Delta 1922, pushback approved. Expect runway 04. Ground, runway 04, pushback approved. Delta 1922. Uh, there's one that's coming into land. I don't know how to say his call sign. Uh, we're going to have to figure that out in a sec. We've got a plane coming into land literally right now as well. Sun Country 536, contact Valata, departure on 119 decimal zero. Yeah, it's all happening, guys. It's all happening. Right, I try and talk to this one. It's called the call sign is V I V five zero eight four. Looking at the uh, companion app, it's called Via Abva. I'm not sure if that's right. Um, but <laughs> I'll try. Via Abva five zero eight four runway zero four clear to land. I think I said it right. Runway 04, cleared to land. Via Abba 5084. Via Abba. Okay, I think I got it. WestJet 2454, runway 04, cleared to land. There's another one. Right, where does this guy need to, to land. 
go. Uh, let's send him via Alpha Foxtrot. American 1287, taxi to ramp via Alpha Foxtrot. But I need to keep my eyes on him. Taxi to ramp um, via Alpha I need Foxtrot. the Delta American to move out of the way. First. Actually, American 1287, hold position. Say again. Ah! Below the ground, Delta 1922, ready to taxi. I think we might be getting a crash here. Um, I don't know what... I need this Delta to go sort of this way. Actually, oh, I have an idea. American 1287, taxi to ramp via Gulf. Taxi to ramp via Gulf. That works. American we'll have him swing around the side. And the Delta can go um, sort of via Foxtrot. That works. Right, here's uh, another plane coming in. Oh, it's one of those green ones. Very cool. Very cool. Um, we've got another WestJet coming in shortly as well. We've got two planes that want to take off. It's all happening, guys. It's all happening in these uh, final uh, few minutes uh, as well. Uh, so we've got 20 minutes left. It's all happening in the latter half of the stream. It's, it's great. Brilliant. Okay. So he should be coming off the runway. We'll have a good look at this plane shortly as well. Uh, we got the uh, Delta over here. He's ready to go now. Delta 1922 taxi. No, 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 no. Delta 1922 runway 04 at Bravo. Say again. Ah! Runway 04 at Bravo. Yeah, thank you. Delta 1922. Thank you. Okay, good, 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 good. Uh, that's looking pretty fantastic, to be honest. All right, this guy, he needs to wait uh, for the Delta to clear. Unless I send him via Fox but I don't think we're going to have enough time looking at the uh, sort of radar here to get him round. Um, anyway, uh, we've got a WestJet coming in hot, or fairly hot. We've got a Southwest one who wants to push back as well. That's fine. Southwest 515, push back approved. Expect runway 04. Looking Ground. quite busy Ground. there Ground. on the uh, flight strip push now. Some One of them's Southwest finished. The West Jet is finished. I can get rid of him. Um, the Americans are nearly finished. Well, let's just watch this. Beautiful. I love this sort of sequence coming in over the beach. It's so nice. And another happy landing. We've got two sets of planes uh, ready to take off as well. As he comes down the runway here, we've got the Air Alaska on the immediate right. And as we pass him, look again to the right, we've got the uh, itsy bitsy one. The private aircraft ready to go. Uh, this guy's waiting over here for the Delta to pass him by. So we're going to have a little bit of a build-up of traffic here as we sort things out. But that's okay, because there's no more incoming planes for a little bit. So we'll have a little bit of a queue. That's fine. He's passing by now. How do I say How do I say his name again? Is it Via Abver? I think it was Via Abver or something like that. Via Abver 508 for Taxi to Ramp. And I did promise you a uh, close-up of this plane as well. Um, where are you? Here we are. Look at that, guys. This is a cool plane. Very, very, very cool. Let's just get a bit of a close-up from this side as well as it goes past. like a nice gentle shade of green isn't it it's beautiful I love it such a cool plane closely followed of course by uh, this dude the West Jet West Jet 2454 taxi to ramp 
taxi to Rand. West Jet 2454. November 701 Echo X ray, runway 04, line up and wait. Runway 04, line up and wait. November right, so that's this ready. dude. We're going to get him lined up, ready to go. Nice little uh, turbo jet there. Um, let's get uh, this guy lined up as well, behind him. Alaska 1377, runway 04, line up and wait. So we've got a few takeoffs now while we wait for our next landing. Our first Alaskan takeoff of the day as well. Very, very cool. So let me just alter things here a little bit. There we go. So we should have two aeroplanes effectively lined up to go. So we've got this guy on Bravo. No, 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 no. I take that back. This guy is on Charlie. And then we've got this one on Bravo. And then we've got another one on Bravo ready to go as well. Let's start off with the small one first. November 701 Echo X ray. Wind is 71 degrees at zero knots. Runway 04 cleared for takeoff. Runway 04 cleared for takeoff. November 701 Echo X ray. Delta 1902, runway 04 at Bravo. Negative. We tried to push back by hand, but we failed. Please send a push back. Oh, is that push back? Okay. Delta 1902. Delta 1902. Actually, he can wait a minute. Southwest 515, runway 04 at Bravo. Runway 04 at Bravo. Southwest 515. Look how much runway this guy needs. Uh, this is starting off at Charlie as well, which is pretty much halfway along. But there we go. November 701 Echo X ray. Contact Valata departure on 119 decimal 0. Valata departure on 119.0. November 701 Echo X ray. Roger. Good day. Alaska 1377, wind is 73 degrees at zero knots, runway 04, cleared for a takeoff. <clears throat> runway zero four, we might, actually, I'm, I was going to say we might have time to take off the uh, Delta as well, but I'm, I'm thinking of waiting because uh, there's a, a better gap coming up. We've got an Air Canada coming in soon. It's just popped up on the radar there. Have a look, guys. There's an Air Canada. There's another itty bitty one coming in as well. Uh, we've got two pushbacks to do. Um, all our incoming planes are pretty much done as I speak. Uh, so three incoming, three outgoing, and two pushbacks. It's going to be a busy end to the stream. Uh, we've got about 14 minutes left. And this is our first Air Alaskan of the day taking off. Air Alaska 1377, contact Valata departure on 119 at decimal zero. Valata departure on 119.0. Right, let's get some pushbacks Roger. done. Good day. Delta 1902, pushback approved. Expect runway 04. Ground, runway 04, pushback approved. Delta 1902. Delta 1948, runway 04, clear to land. Better get that one in quickly before he does actually land. Runway 04. Where is he? There land. he is. Delta 1948. X-ray Alpha Uniform Quebec Mike. Pushback approved. Expect runway 04. Ground. Runway 04. Pushback approved. X-ray Alpha Uniform Quebec Mike. It's a Viva Abha plane. A Via Via Abha. I can't remember how to say it. Via Abha 3231. Pushback approved. Expect runway 04. I think I said it right. <laughs> Ground runway 04. Pushback approved. Right. Via Abha 3231. Let's get uh, the Delta sent off. Delta 19922. Runway 04. Line up and wait. And the Southwest runway is right behind him as well. Delta 1922. 
Air Canada, 9999er, runway 04, clear to land. Oh, he didn't hear me, let's try again. Air Canada, 9999er, runway 04, clear to land. Say again. Runway 04, clear to land. Thank Air you. Air Canada, 999er. Thank Bell you. Tower. X-ray Alpha Juliet Sierra Tango on final zero four. X-ray Alpha Juliet Sierra Tango runway zero four clear to land. It's all happening again. Zero four, right, I'm gonna send this guy via Alpha. Uh, X-ray Alpha Juliet Alpha Sierra Tango. Valardi ground. Yeah. Delta one nine or zero two ready to taxi. Delta one nine zero two runway zero four at Bravo. Just see what route he wants to take. Bravo. Delta That's fine. Delta one nine four eight. Taxi to ramp via Alpha Golf. Taxi to ramp via Alpha Golf. That's good. Delta one nine four eight. That should work out quite ground. nicely. Alpha Uniform Quebec Mike ready to taxi. Delta one nine two two. Wind is seven nine degrees at zero knots. Runway zero four. Cleared for takeoff. So he's got clearance. It's all happening, guys. It's all happening. So 515 is ready to go. The Delta is taxiing now. Via Abha 3231, runway 04 at Bravo. Runway 04 at Bravo. We are the 3231. Thank you. X-ray Alpha Uniform Quebec Mike Runway Zero Four at Charlie. Runway Zero Four at Charlie. X-ray Alpha Uniform Quebec Mike. And this one's done. Delta One Nine Two Two Contact Valata Departure on One One Nine Decimal Zero. Departure. Right, we've got the Air Canada uh, landing. Good day, and Bell after the Air uh, Canada, on final zero hmm. four. there's a very, I don't think we can get, I don't think we can get any takeoffs done until Bell after the Sky down. West lands. Um, I might increase separation to five nautical miles. Here's the Air Canada anyway, passing over the beach. Beautiful plane. Beautiful. Ah. Uh. Shall I just try? Southwest 515, runway 04, cleared for immediate takeoff. This is very risky. <laughs> I've been a bit naughty. I don't think, like, guys, we, we may have a little crash here. I don't think. I don't think we can do this. But I've committed now. If I have to, I'll tell the X ray Alpha to go around. But we've committed. Um, here's the radar so you can see what's happening. The X-ray Alpha is super, super, super close. Um, can oh, we can see him. We can see him. He is, he is, he is there. Did I tell five one five to contact departure? Oh no, he's the one that's going now. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm with it. I'm with it. Skywest three three six three runway zero four clear to land. I think we're gonna be runway all right, guys. Four. It's going to be close, but Sky I think we're going to be all right. Air Canada, Niner, 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 taxi to ramp. Taxi to ramp. Air Canada, Niner, Niner, Niner. Thank you, good sir. Well, we did it, guys. We did it. We did it. We're safe. Proper pros on this game. Southwest 515, contact Velata, departure on 119, decimal zero. And here he is. Departure on one one nine oh zero. yeah. Southwest five one five. Roger. Good day. Good day. So we've got a small plane taking off on Charlie in a minute. Two planes to take off on Bravo in a minute. Uh, we've got Sky West uh, coming into land as well. And that should take us uh, to the end of the stream. Uh, just clearing these last few. Uh, aeroplanes on our flight strip. X-ray 
X-Ray Alpha Uniform Quebec. Actually, there's no time. There's no time. I was going to have him line up and wait, but I'm going to wait. There's no time. You can see him there on the right-hand side. Like, the Sky West is literally so freaking close. It's not worth it. Um, in fact, we might be able to see him now. There he is. The uh, the small one that's just come in. He's not even turned off yet. Like, this is going to be super, super close. Uh, he should turn off on Delta, which is just coming up now on his right-hand side. Please turn off. Please? Yeah, I think he is. He's slowing down. X-Ray Alpha Juliet Sierra Tango. Taxi to ramp. Taxi right, to Sky ramp. West. X-Ray Alpha Juliet Sierra Here Tango. Here we go. Beautiful. Oh, it's... It's an Alaskan operated by Sky West. Interesting. Very interesting. So there we go. We're going to get planes lined up to go instantly here. So let's see who's my first one going to be. It's going to be the Delta. Okay. We'll just wait for him to get past. Make sure it's safe. Delta 19002, runway 04. Line up and wait. Runway 04. Line up let's and get wait. the small one ready. Delta X-ray Alpha Uniform Quebec Mike. Runway 04. Line up and wait. Runway 04. Line up and wait. X-ray Alpha Uniform Quebec Mike. This is what the flight strip looks like. So we've got Alpha uh, X-ray Alpha who's taxiing back to ramp. He's nearly done. The Sky West who's just popped up. Uh, we've got Delta 19002, who's uh, getting ready to take off. Uh, another X-Ray Alpha, who's getting ready to take off. Uh, the Via Abha, however you say that. He'll be getting ready to go in a moment. And at that point, uh, we should be pretty much uh, done. X-Ray Alpha, Uniform Quebec Mike. Wind is 9 at 0 degrees at 0 knots. Runway 04, cleared for takeoff. Very small plane, so I don't imagine he's going to need um, much takeoff time. Skywest 3363, taxi to ramp. We'll see him there at the corner of our eyes. That one's done. There we go, didn't take long at all, did it? Delta 19002, wind is 901 degrees at zero knots, runway 04, clear for takeoff. Oh! Ah, oh, come on! He. Right, chat, come on. This is not a mistake. <laughs> uh, okay, I, I lost 100 points for the separation. Runway but do you know what? This guy's already airborne. By the Delta time. By the time the Delta is airborne, the separation would have been fine. Like, trust me, guys. I'm, I'm a pro at this game. That's a little bit sad. Uh, it says the separation was too um, uh, too short. But you know what? He's all the way over here now. The separation would have been fine. It's just me being me, I guess. Anyway. Via Abha 3231. Runway 04. Cleared for immediate takeoff. Runway 04. Cleared for immediate takeoff. X-Ray Alpha Uniform Quebec Mike Contact Velata Departure of 119 Decimal Zero. Like I should have that one. Velata Departure on 119.0. X-Ray Alpha Uniform Quebec Mike. Roger. Good day. Delta 1902. Contact Velata Departure on 119 Decimal Zero. Velata Departure on 119.0. Delta 1902. Roger. Good day. Delta 1865. Runway 04. Clear to land. Runway 04. Clear to land. This is what the flight trip looks like. It, uh, this is our last departure. We've got Skywest 3363, who is nearly, uh, nearly uh, back at his stand. And there's a uh, Delta coming in. I might finish with that Delta. Delta, I don't know, like it's still a minute or so away, and this guy's nearly in the air. Uh, so yeah, uh, it may only uh, be one runway, guys, but you know what? It's a pretty busy runway, as you've seen. 
Uh, pretty, pretty busy. Via Abha 3231, contact Valata Departure on 119 decimal zero. Okay, he didn't hear me. Probably said it wrong. <laughs> Via Abha three two three one contact Valata departure on one one nine and decimal zero. Okay, he heard me that time. On See the other planes zero. in the distance as well. It's quite funny. Three, two, three, Good, day. Good day. So there we go. All our outgoing planes are done. We will finish with this Delta. Um, you can only just see it. And you know what? This is a fun airport. I've really enjoyed uh, playing it, guys. And if you haven't bought it yet, and you like Tower Simulator 3, you like the challenge of a new airport, I uh, definitely, definitely encourage you to um, to get it. Like, I have every single Tower Sim airport. I love this game so much. And yeah, I have the most streamed games of Tower Simulator 3 of anyone on the internet that I know of. Which is something I'm very, very proud of. Anyway, this is our last landing of the day. You can actually kind of see the plane in the distance there coming in. That's quite cool. Uh, but let's go and uh, do the uh, cinematic uh, cinematic landing of this plane. Uh, where is he? Eight, 1865. There he is. And uh, we're going to call it quits there. Welcome. Welcome to Jalisco, Mexico. There we go. Uh, I think we're going to call it that. Let's press escape. And back to menu. And hopefully, uh, it'll take us back to the menu. There we go. Successful takeoffs, 12. Successful landings, 10. Perfect. All right, guys. Uh, thank you so much. As a reminder, you can get your merch, your ATC Harry merch, at my uh, Stream Elements shop. Just exclamation mark merch in the chat. I'll click the links from the chat bot. And you can also uh, subscribe to me on Kofi, uh, bronze, silver, gold. Uh, don't forget, I've got a dono gold somewhere in the corner. Feel free to contribute to that too. Uh, but that's it from me uh, for today. Anyway, uh, this stream is on a loop. Uh, I'm not doing a 24-hour loop. Uh, it will end when I go to bed tonight sometime. Um, so if you're watching this on the 1st of March 2024, uh, the screen will go black and then it will just uh, restart. And if you're not, well, the stream will just be over. <laughs> Thanks so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this first look at MMPR. Thank you so much for watching. O7s in the chat. And I will see you very, very soon. Goodbye. Okay, hello everyone. Uh, I bet you thought the stream was going to end there, didn't you? Well... You're wrong. Um, so very quickly, if you've enjoyed what you've seen today, please consider subscribing to me on Kofi. We have a bronze, silver, and gold level of subscription. And uh, every subscription really does help me uh, with my day-to-day -day living expenses. And also it allows me to continue streaming for you guys every single day. Uh, each level comes with a whole bunch uh, of perks. So please, Check it out, and uh, maybe, just maybe, I'll see you on Kofi very soon. Okay, see you in the next stream.